I'm going to be showing you the iOS 7, which I've currently made from Cydia Tweaks and Themes via Winterboard and Cydia. So, I'm going to give you a demonstration on what I can do with this. Then, maybe in the next video, I will show you how to do it. So, alright, let's start it by showing you that when you just drag down on something like photos here. I can do, I can like see everything on there, not at the moment very well because I haven't set it out properly, let's close that, and then you can, you can do that on pretty much anything, like settings and stuff, I can't do it very well, I'm not very used to it, but yeah, you get all of that, well it's kind of pointless, but yeah, I guess so, alright, now I'm going to show you the lock screen, as you see in the Apple icons on the start, so here's my lock screen, it hasn't loaded properly because I'm recording, so it's a bit slow. Right, here we go. Here's my home screen. See, it's kind of blurred out as I haven't set it up completely right. But there's a drag bar at the top. Drag that down here, yeah, whatever. A few emails and stuff. Then you can slide across here. Your respring and your Wi-Fi and VPN, all the settings from in. Like the actual settings and stuff. So close that. Yeah, you notice the camera's at the bottom. Slide it to unlock. See at the top left corner, you got the bars for your connection and your Wi-Fi. But the bars for your connection is much like different. So it's little dots instead of the old bars. Um, as you notice, the battery icon in the top right is white and stuff. Well, it always was, but as you can see now, I'm going to put it on charge, and you will see that it will turn green. There you go. Turn green, it has a little charging icon next to it. And then, here it is on the utilities. As you can see, the folders have got a nice white background to it. All the icons are flat, and it's got the actual background in it as well. More transparent. So go, flick for a bit. Here's another thing that I like, is the multitasking bit as well. Because when I double tap, I get this instead. Here, yeah, yes. calendar, app store's open. Got linked to Candy Crush, so yeah. So you can like, open it from there. Close it again. And you can also, I haven't managed to get the control center yet, as I don't think there's a proper one out. But if you slide up, I've still got this, I didn't bother with the OXO theme. I themed it a bit with this with the iOS 7, but that's about it. Anyway, so I'm just wondering if you want anything to show. Here's my notification center. Not the actual iOS 7 one, but came with the theme. And yeah, you got the top bar and stuff for the weather. Scroll across that thing, pointless, but yeah. Um, so, in the actual messages, I'll show you. Hopefully, numbers pop up, but yeah, well, couldn't care less. It's gonna take a while because I'm recording. So, alright, here we go. Right, as you can see, I just wanna show you this. My font on my keyboard is different, and the I've got a plus icon that is different as well. And I've got a different colour background and stuff, as it's a like lighter blue, I think. If you notice the status bar, it always changes to which app you're on. So say I went on like WhatsApp, it changed to blue, ongoing and stuff like that. So I'm just going to show you what themes I have set up on it, and tell me if I should activate anything better, I guess. So. Here you go, I've got like the flat app icons and stuff like that. All the iOS stuff set from the iPad ones. Yeah. Oh yeah, that that's the name of the thing where you slide down and the I icons is Vlox as well. So you got folder announcers and stuff like that. Yeah, that's all of them. So go back from here. And I wanted to show you this in particular. Safari when you slide Swipe down on that, you get a little safari bar here, which is very good. Like, I'll show you, it works.
takes its time, but then that's just my phone and my internet. So my phone is quite old, it's only a 3GS. So, here we go. Right, there we are. A bit slow, but oh well. Still loading, but I can't bother to wait. There you go. Right, let's close that. Slow my phone down. So, now you've seen that, I guess. Oh yeah, this search at the end is much different as you've got a bar at the top, like a rectangle bar instead of the old circle. And then that's it, I think. So, thanks for watching. Please like, rate, and subscribe. Comment as you do.